Here is a quick overview and some advice from students about how to keep up in your online class. Online classes are convenient. However, many students are unaware of the discipline, time management, and organizational skills required to be successful. Though you can arrange your own schedule to pace your studying and when you do your work, most online courses are not completely self-paced. They have assignment due dates and deadlines. You are responsible for staying on top of things, knowing when homework is due and meeting those deadlines. Your plan should include daily access to a reliable computer with internet and arrangements as a backup if it becomes unavailable. You need some basic technical and troubleshooting skills. Finally, you need to understand how your class is laid out and where to find things and how to use the features and functions in your course shell. Preparing yourself with these basic tools will get you off to a good start. First, visit your Falcon Online course shell at least every other day, if not daily. Read announcements and review your grades. Next, check your Falcon Mail email using that same schedule, at least every other day, if not daily. Look for instructor updates and communications from the college. If you sent an email with a question or request, make sure to check back frequently, even a few times a day, to look for a response. For example, if you request an assignment extension, you may only be given a short window to submit. In this class, you will want to review the course and homework schedule page. On this page, found in content, you will be able to see the full semester schedule of textbook reading, online material review, and assignment types and due dates. The course is set up in modules. They correspond to your textbook. On the course homework schedule, you will see what is due each week that includes assignments, their due dates, and the type of assignment, such as uploading a document to a folder, posting to a discussion, or completing a quiz, and the release conditions you must meet to unlock that assignment and future content. A common error students make is waiting until the due date to upload work. The due date for an assignment is actually a deadline. The date and time indicate when the assignment will close and lock you out from access. You should submit well before that due date to avoid problems that may either delay your submission or to allow you to get assistance so that you can submit better quality work. The Pulse app is a great tool. It provides reminders and alerts related to announcements, upcoming due dates, grade updates, and more. It is convenient. However, it does not replace your course and homework schedule. You are still responsible for meeting the due dates listed on that document, regardless of receiving or not receiving notifications and reminders from Pulse. If you do not have a smartphone, you can use notifications. You can adjust these settings to receive emails or text alerts and reminders. By your name in Falcon Online, you will find the notifications option where you can adjust those settings and enter your cell number if you want texts. Your course and homework schedule is the best place to check for due dates. However, you can also find them right on each assignment in your course shell. If the course and homework schedule indicates that you need to upload to the assignment folder, it will appear under Assignments if you have met the release conditions. Watch the Course Guide Part 2 video for more on release conditions. The due date and time appear in the due date column so you can see exactly when that particular assignment is due. If the schedule indicates a quiz is due, it will appear under Quizzes. If you have not met the release conditions, the quiz will not appear in the list. The due date and time appear below the name of the quiz, so you can see the window of time you have to complete the quiz. If the schedule indicates a discussion is due, it will appear under Discussions. If you have not met the release conditions, the discussion will not appear in the list. The due date and time appear below the name of the discussion, so you can see the window of time you have to complete the discussion. So here are a few pieces of advice from students to stay on track. Take time early in the week to get a sense of what is due. Spend 15 minutes reviewing your course and homework schedule, flipping through the textbook reading that's due, and look at the online course module and the links that you need to watch and read. Figure out what you need to complete and make a plan. You will need to estimate not only how much time it will take, but when you are planning to get it done. Finally, don't procrastinate. Complete your work ASAP to give yourself enough time to get help, ask questions, complete quality work, and submit with time to spare in case of a tech issue.
If you are unsure how to use the features and functions in your online course shell, contact your instructor immediately. We can set up an appointment to walk you through, talk you through, or whatever it takes to help you get comfortable with the environment so you can focus on completing your work. Don't wait until it's too late. If you need help, communicate. We are here to help you succeed.